Hi everyone, this is Mariana, trainer and technical documentation developer at In-House Solutions. I'm here with Mastercam quick tip of the day. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to create a custom reference position in Milturn using the Machine Reference Position Manager. A reference position is a predefined machine position stored in Mastercam with a unique name. Custom reference positions can be created in the part file and they can also be added in the machine definition. In Mastercam Simulator, you can see that in the right spindle, I'm facing and finishing the part using the upper right turret and roughing using the lower turret. Let's check the uh, approach reference position for the lathe face. As you can see, the turret is going to be located at Z minus 10 inches. And for the lathe finish, the approach is set to 8.258 inches. I'm going to change the Z value for both approaches to be uh, 7 inches. Back in Mastercam, in the Toolpaths Manager, I'm going to click on Edit Reference Points and the Machine Reference Position Manager will be automatically open. I'm going to use this upper X only return. You will see in the Sync Manager that this is the reference point used uh, for the approach. And I'm going to uh, duplicate it and create a new one. I will rename this uh, reference position right spindle index position. The same thing will be for the comment. And as far as type goes, I'm just going to use reference. Axis combination is the upper right. And for Z axis, I'm going to use offset from home position and just enter the value seven inches. Okay, for now. I'm launching Sync Manager. I'm going to click on the drop down arrow next to the lathe face. And as you can see, the reference position that defines uh, where this operation begins was set up to upper X only return. I'm going to change it to the right spindle index position. And I'll do the same thing for the lathe face right spindle index position. We'll save the changes and then you can relaunch uh, Mastercam Simulator. In uh, Mastercam Simulator, you can scroll down and find the lathe face approach. Notice how close the tool is now to the part. This concludes the quick tip of the day. Thank you for watching.